Hey, what's up guys? It's the Blonde Tiger and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I bought uh, a pack of 30 different Japanese snacks on Amazon. This idea came from, if you remember my trying German candy video way back, like four years ago. I said that if the video got 10 likes, I would do this again. And uh, what do you know? It got 10 likes, so uh, I'm proud of you guys. This is how they look. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah. Hoping these are actually real Japanese snacks and I just get bamboozled on Amazon. Right. They they just threw a butterscotch in here. That that I don't know if this is actually Japanese stuff, but it just looks like they just threw butterscotch in there. Oh my goodness, I hope that's not black licorice. Another one of those. What is this? Po Pikachu bubblegum? What? What? Pikachu bubblegum. <laughs> Everything, everything's Japanese and all crap, you know. Hopefully that's gum. I don't know. It seems like it'd be. Some rocks. Probably like rock candy. Boogers or something. I don't know. Uh, that looks like a... a that looks like candy hearts, but like a Japanese symbol instead. Uh, I don't really know what this is. It looks like it's just liquid jelly. That's what it says, jelly. Right there. Jelly. And then, oh. What? <laughs> what? I don't know what this says, but, um, I assure you, I hope this isn't... <laughs> what? I just grabbed this. Uh, this is from the snack pack that I got on Amazon. It's probably like M&Ms, but why in like a medicine? And then there's this. That looks actually kind of cool. Kind of looks like a, a bonsai tree or something like that. Or like mossy stuff. Pocky sticks probably or something like noodle sticks. And then whatever this is. Looks pretty colorful. Yeah. Right. A salad pretzel. Uh, I don't know. Right, let's see here. This is by right here. Yummy, yummy. Happy snacks. I think they gave you like a sticker too. <laughs> it's a Mickey Mouse. Like a marshmallow of Mickey Mouse. Ooh, what's this? This is just all black. You know what? I might actually die from that. From this. <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully. It seems very intimidating. Whatever this is. <laughs> Alright, we'll save that for last. The Ichigo Cream. I don't, I don't know what this is. I don't know why I'm starting off with this one, but we'll go with this one first. Oh goodness. Okay, it looks like a cracker, but with like cream, like strawberry cream on it on the inside. And that's exactly what it tastes like. Honestly, um, not bad. Not, I don't know, not amazing. I mean, it's just a cracker with cream. You can't really do much with that. I don't know, maybe three, four out of ten. Yeah, whatever this is. What is? <laughs> what? This is just the candy that you're supposed to like dip. So like, all right. So there's the little, their little Kool-Aid man they got on the back there, and then like you know, right on the inside of there, there's like a powder. I don't know if you can see it very well. Oh gosh. I don't know if you can see it very well, but there's a powder. All right. 
and just probably this person would like be like Ooh. Okay, so this tastes like Coke. Okay, I'm getting this. This this popsicle right here tastes like Coke. And you dip it in this powder, right? Which I hope is also not Coke. <laughs> Just kidding. I don't know. And then, um, yeah, and just like sugar, I guess. It tastes pretty dang good, if I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, yeah, I was solid like seven. Solid seven or eight out of ten right there. Honestly, I would love this in America. I don't know what it is. But have have it more of it. We got this little grassy gnome bonsai cracker thing. I think this is actually gonna be pretty good. It smells like a, like a honey cracker, and I'm expecting it to also kind of maybe be like a marshmallow. That'd be kind of cool. Hmm. Yeah, not at all what I was expecting. <laughs> it tastes like like this wheat seaweed for some reason. I don't know if there's like a seaweed bar or whatever it is, but like, it's not bad. That's not what I was expecting. Oh, why there are a lot of snacks that are like just like crackers. I'm gonna stop eating crackers so much right now. I don't want crackers anymore. Um, let's go for this honey bear thing. Right here. Yeah. Probably just regular gummy bear, but yeah. Hmm. Okay, so now I'm a sucker for gummy bear, so <laughs> this is pretty good. But yeah, it's classic. You can't really go wrong with uh, gummy bears unless you like make it terrible. All right, yeah, this one I forgot. This one, the black licorice looking one which I hope is not actually black licorice flavor it looks wild honestly like it looks like uh, that one game I'll probably put a video up on it about somewhere um, but that one game where you're all weird and, and like, I can't explain it I'll just put it up but yeah it looks like that game behind me or oh oof this is a, it looks like gum. Mm. Yeah, I wasn't expecting gum. Seems great flavored, but like there's some red stuff on it. Which you can see right there. It's like turned red. So you put your tongue on it, right, and get it wet. Start showing like these red dots on it. I really don't know if you can see it. And there's like red dots on the Pretty weird. This one seems a little bit different than what I thought it was in the inside the package. You know? I don't know what this says. Someone knows Japanese and can read that for me. Be my guess. It's like a little bit more powdery than I thought. Like A 
what? Oh man. Oh. That was wild. I have no idea what to think about this one. It literally just tastes like kind of like bread. I bit into it like hard, and then it went it went through like marshmallow kind of, and then like what? It felt like sugar on my teeth, and probably just a block of sugar. I didn't rate the last two. Um. Oh. Huh. Weird, strong taste to it. Um. I would give it a three, the last one, and then one before that, maybe a four. I don't know. These aren't. I mean, they're snacks, right? I don't know. They're pretty. They're pretty decent. I'm not disappointed by any of these. They're all kind of. I don't know. I mean, they're snacks. I'm just saying they're not top of the tier yet. Besides um, that Coke thing. All right. We're going ahead and eat Mickey Mouse right now. I like how this. They didn't even try with like the attempt to make it look like Mickey Mouse or anything. Like, I'm pretty sure they just put a marshmallow in a bag and put Mickey Mouse on it. See? That is a very weirdly firm marshmallow. <laughs> I'm not really sure how I like the ends of it hanging <laughs> on. It's like they just literally tied a pillow up together on both ends, you know? And they just... Oh! There's something inside of it. Hold on. Well, there's chocolate inside. It honestly don't look great. <laughs> like in theory it seems like it would be a good idea but I don't know it look great yeah it tastes like a hot chocolate kind of now let's try this good old Texas corn yeah <laughs> no. I don't know what I'm doing with my life All my exes went into Texas. My goodness, like it's good, but the only way I can just figure out how to describe this one, the taste of this one, is like those um, Vinny sausages, whatever those. Or what they're actually called, but like, yeah, Vinny's sausages or something like that. And the ones in the can, you know, this, like, with all the liquid in it and crap. This, that's literally what this tastes like. But it's like, like a Cheeto. A weird flavor to put in a chip. I never would have thought about that, but not bad. We'll try to just get some of these small ones out of the way. I'm guessing it's like a mix between nerds and uh, those rock candies or whatever. You see the caves or whatever the crap. Pretty much. Pretty nice overall. Probably like a 5 out of 10. These are pretty basic candies. I would consider this to be like the baseline for candy like taste. With this, that Texas, Texas corn, probably about like an eight or seven, probably seven. All right. Oh, this one says Cuppy Ramoon, Ramoon, Ramoon on the back. Yeah. I don't know what that means, but it's what it says. That one alone 
I hope that's not the only flavor because that one alone was like a point two on the flavor scale. It wasn't even. Oh my gosh. So I don't know what that was. It tasted like freaking. <clears throat> I don't know. I kind of forgot already. <laughs> it's, it tasted like they were just trying to mix like really strong lemonade with frog legs or something like that some type of sea salad <laughs> and it wasn't great that one was better it just tastes like strawberry I think that's it yeah okay well that one really is like probably like a 0.5 on taste altogether because it wasn't good really uh yeah <laughs> so the next thing will be this little thing here that's kind of like a sour patch kids or whatever uh extreme airhead something rip off i don't know <laughs> It almost tastes good. It tastes kind of the same, but kind of like the cough drop version of it. Mm. This one's definitely a three. Wow. Mm. Has just has such a bad acid taste. Ooh. Woo. This one looks like a banana with chocolate in it. Like that's really just what it looks like on the thing. So we're gonna try that one next. Which I swear, if it's just another marshmallow with chocolate in it, <laughs> which I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Oh, it's marshmallow with chocolate with a banana coating on it. You see? I don't know why it just looks like a. And guy in a sleeping bag laying down. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'm not a fan. Not a fan. I can see how people might like that one, but I'm not a fan. Too much banana, too much chocolate, not enough mellow. Definitely like probably a two or a one. That was not not my did not mess with my taste buds. All right. Well, guess we might as well try this. Anyone that knows how to read Japanese? Please read this and make sure it doesn't say anything bad. <laughs> And if uh, it does, then won't. Well, whoops. Yep. Just chocolate. That's what I thought. That's what it looked like. But, I took the gamble there for the YouTube clickbait. <laughs> now, this one. That's what it looks like. Oh god. I bit into that and it felt like a stick. And it really tasted like a stick. I guess that's why I was so. Oh. It kind of tastes like honey smacks. Now that I think about it. Like the honey gram honey smacks, whatever. Kind of tastes like that, but without any milk and not as good. Ooh, salad sticks incoming. Smell test. Oh. Smell test. 
Yeah, it smells like salad, but it doesn't smell bad. Like, it smells pretty good. Here you get you get a whiff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm, that's pretty good. No complaints on the sticks. Six out of ten. That's a good rating for me. All right, five is average. That's how it goes. All right. I'm wondering why I like whenever I ordered candy, they sent so many cracker type variations, you know? But here. I don't know what this is a mini pack of, but it says mini pack. It looks kind of like those like spicy like pepper things. So seeds, but I don't know if it's what they are. But we'll see. If it is, then bam. Oops. They're not bad, but there's not a great taste, you know. But that's not bad. Mm. Okay, my mouth said that it got a little bit worse. You eat a little bit too fast. The, mm, the taste starts to stack up on you. I don't know. Give me real, real nasty bath, nasty bathroom like taste that I was on the back of my taste was, and I'm not, not liking it. You know, I bought these things thinking I would have a good time coming on here and just eating food and entertaining people possibly <laughs> and I'm, it feels like I'm just getting tortured almost with all these with all these foods I'm just having wow <coughs> dang <coughs> oh. my taste buds are like not thinking right now <laughs> I don't hate everything it's, some of it's good some of it's bad this is not great ooh these look like funny though Oh man, it looks like funyuns and it smells like ketchup and mustard. Oh my gosh, literally, oh, it smells like a, like a kid's section of a McDonald's. I'm not liking this right now. That's what they look like. Yeah. It tastes just like a cheeseburger with ketchup and mustard. I don't know really about the cheeseburger part, but the ketchup and mustard I can definitely taste. But it's not that bad. It's weird. Mm. Oof. Really a lot of ketchup you taste. Like the sweetness of it. I have to give that like a Maybe like four. I'm gonna go with four. Four or five. Uh, probably four. <laughs> <laughs> now we'll try this French thing. This French roll cracker. French Ontario. This looks kind of like a fortune cookie. Like a fortune cookie cracker type thing, you know? Type deal. Oh my goodness. Kind of looked good for a second. And now I regret it. And like, look at that. Like, this looks fine. That, not so much. Like, what did Trek do to this, like, cracker log here? Like, I don't know if it's like avocado or like the uh, wasabi. I hope it's not wasabi, but I hope it's nothing worse either. <laughs> Man, it kind of looks just like a, like a snot rocket, like just like, like literally just like uh, I don't know.
And I was right on it being a fortune fortune cookie. It's really ironic because it's um just French. Seems ironic to me, but that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> the the cream isn't that bad, I don't think. Yeah, honestly, I'm kind of surprised. I like it. So this next one is a lollipop candy ice stick lipstick. The only thing here really that has any English on it. Um, and it's like mostly English except for the back. Yeah, some Japanese and stuff. Alright. Well. Hmm. So like. Yo, I don't know if this actually works, because <laughs> I can't read it anything on the back of the <laughs> on the back of the package. But it tastes like lipstick, like legitimately. And I feel like my lips have lipstick on it. Kind of. I don't know if it's just the, my brain associating it, the taste or what. But um. Yeah. Honestly, not that. I kind of like it. I'm just going to get this going. Like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I really don't know, but it, if this is actually like lipstick, this as a lollipop, an edible, I kind of feel like that's a genius um, candy. Um, so I don't know. I've, I've, I'm putting this at a nine. All right, this is the best one so far. Yeah. Pleasantly surprised, pleasantly surprised. Alright, we're gonna do a lightning round of things. This one kinda looks just like a cracker with a marshmallow. <sighs> we'll see how right I am. Yep, cracker. Wait, whoa, it came out in two. Whoa, okay, I thought it was in half for a second. No, it was just two. Okay. It's actually pretty good. It tastes like a lot of like the. It's not a marshmallow. It tastes like a lot of like the cream crackers we have here, right? But so much better. <laughs> like honestly, this one's really good. And they taste like really like I don't know fancy, and they kind of look fancy too. But they taste I don't know richer, but not as strong. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm gonna taste, take some of this Texas corn to, to, to get some of these taste buds. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Reset the palate. Not regretting my decisions yet. There's this, which is kind of like Pop Rocks thing, I think. Yo, what is up with Japan's weird candy styles? Like, but it literally just looks like, like, medicine, kind of, <laughs> or rocks. Pop rock. Surprisingly a good combination though, honestly, like, kind of balances each other out. Very weird. Very weird. Yeah. 
I'm not a big fan of Pop Rocks. So, yeah, I, I, I was wondering even if I, I kind of didn't even want to do that one to be honest, but I did it for you guys. So subscribe right now, like it, you know, ring the notification bell, comment below, please. I want people to talk to me. <laughs> and then this one is just really, really small ramen noodle sticks. Really small. I haven't seen this small. And it tastes like french fries. Honestly. That's pretty dang good. I know what I'm eating later tonight. Alright, so now we're down to the final couple, which are butterscotch. Which I wouldn't tell as Japanese. I'm pretty sure it just got thrown into here by mistake from someone from Japan ordering English snacks. That's what I'm going to choose to think what happened. So I'm not eating this off camera, I guess. But this right here is the Pikachu gum. Mm -hmm. Hoping this one tastes pretty electrifying, you know, you know what I'm saying? You know, so let's take a peek. Uh, you know, <laughs> Very weird. Idea. Okay, this is just the same as before with a little um, bazooka bubblegum type fortune thing. It's just, uh, yeah. This actually says anything real that I need to know. Uh, comment below, let me know. Um, yeah, besides that, I guess we're just gonna eat this. Yeah, no. I had high hopes, but it tastes like a carnival bathroom. I'm just gonna be honest. But I'm not hoping, I don't know how to open this, unfortunately. So freaking weird. We're gonna cheat on the opening process and just open it in a little bit differently. Woo! Okay, so it's not. Okay, so it's not all a uh, liquid. That's good to know. Oh, look at it protrude out of that thing. Uh, Alright. Mm. <laughs> Not what I thought was going to happen. Mm. That is so weird. That literally tastes like like those ice popsicles you would eat. like preschool or something like that but like a, as a jelly and I'll be honest with you I'm not sure about how I feel about this substance like it tastes pretty good and feels decent but it also feels like I'm eating an alien so uh, yeah I might pass now Like, look at that. Man. Also, I'll show you what else it looks like. That might be behind me, too. I don't know. Um, I want to just put that right there. I might uh, eat that later. I don't know. I'm still deciding on if it's an Amy or not. Or if it's alive. <laughs> Alright, last thing. Final thing. The black. Small thing. I hope this is really good because I kind of hyped it up a little bit near the end. Uh, so, yeah. Ooh, okay, so. Look, it's like it's all black. All black. Oh, no, never mind. It's like that little yellowish amber tint to it, but it's still pretty much all black. So, yeah. Mm. 
tastes like chocolate so far. I'm just gonna take a break into that. That's what it looks like on the side. Yeah. Dang it. The guys with the secret butterscotch candy. <laughs> like who looks at this and sees a butterscotch? You know? I'll get this installed death. Man. Alright, well. Um, in the end I still ended up eating a butterscotch candy, which was disappointing. <laughs> But I um, hope you guys liked the video and enjoyed uh, nonetheless. So maybe if we, if we can start hitting more like goals, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna give a like goal of five for this video. That that's fine. Um, <laughs> yeah. But yeah. So anyway, I uh, hope you guys like the video. Subscribe. You know, y'all know what to do. Uh, peace.